Hi and welcome to Made in the West Film Festival 2019. Beautiful filmmakers have come from all around the West to bring you here what we're about to see. Hold on to your chairs and enjoy the ride. I'm here with Ross Page, the founder and artistic director of this beautiful festival. Tell me a little bit about why you love it. Why did you start it? Oh wow. Um, why I love this festival is to um, see all these filmmakers with the glam and glitter of walking on the red carpet and seeing their films on the big screen. Um, it's just amazing to see people light up and be inspired and to continue making films. And that just fuels me. As a filmmaker, that fuels me. I think um, by doing this, we grow together. Oh, this festival. I love it. It's really an incredible showcase for what's going on in the West and the budding talent that's kind of emerging and making its way across Sydney. Western Sydney filmmakers tend to be talented across the board. They, you know, write the script, they develop the script, they film it themselves, they edit it themselves. Um, that we do have voices and great stories to tell. You know, festivals like this can showcase talent in Western Sydney and that will bring more attraction to Western Sydney filmmakers. It's pretty much the only film festival right now celebrating Western Sydney filmmaking, so there's just such a richness of culture and identity and, and you know, a lot of emerging talent. It's really exciting to, to be part of that. The festival tonight has been, has been terrific. The diversity of the stories and the power of the stories is fantastic yeah. to be part yeah, of Yeah, really fantastic. Being able to celebrate them with people and meet new people as well has been really exciting. And so this was really particularly fun to do because over 60 people worked on it. And so it was really great to see it up on the big screen. And that's because of Made in the West. I feel that the whole level of what they're putting out is just through the roof. When you watch these films, you just see like every single film is exceptional. And it just makes me really proud to be from this area. Made in the West 2019. When I watch the movies, made by so many great young talents that made in the West. I don't see average Australians, I see extraordinary ones. And I think it's really important to kind of not just show or represent this diversity, but to truly celebrate it in the way that made in the West does. It's funny, it's sad, it's moving, it's always memorable and always inspiring. Our film is a short documentary and it's about the women in the SES, the State Emergency Services in New South Wales. Um, it's followed the story of one woman called Evie in um, her unit, which is Search and Rescue Unit on a Missing Persons case. So we follow her story and her experiences. Our short film is called Ankara Pride and it follows an amazing Nigerian fashion designer who came to Sydney when she was 17. She goes through her journey about what it's like to kind of make that transition from Nigeria to Sydney and just how it was really tough for her and it still is. She encourages people, especially people that might not have been born in Australia, how they can kind of persevere and push through. Larry time is about Larry. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's about two very twisted sisters who want to give their grandmother the best present that they possibly can, and she likes this TV show, and so... It's basically his biggest fan getting the gift of some Larry time. You are a winner. My short metrage is called Campesino. It's about the gauchos of Patagonia, and the life and... Eh, del, del trabajo que hacen y la vida de soledad que, que viven. Um, yeah. Y ese la filmé en Patagonia, Chile, y hace unos años ya, pero yeah, de, de eso se trata de la de mascul de masculinidad eh, y de sole soledad. And I think what I learned from that is just um, how headstrong you have to be uh, to do a job like that, but also like just belief in yourself, which is um, pretty important. Yeah. If you were to tell any emerging young filmmakers from out the West and just in general um, that wanted to enter into a competition, they were just a bit on the fence, as a bit of advice, what would you say to them? Just do it. 
just do it. I mean, really, anyone can make films these days. It's, it's that exciting. All you need is a good story to tell. Plenty of people want to be involved too. You know, that's mm. what we found out very early on. You know, a lot of people want to be involved with short movies. It's terrific culture now. So uh, stick your hand up, wave the flag, get on social media, find some people who want to be involved, tell the story. Because at the end of the day, we all want to express ourselves and being a part of that expression is super important. If you're a student, this is the best way to get acknowledgement and I know everyone hates the word exposure, but it does help. You get to meet people and you get to join and be part of a community and that in itself is good. That's fantastic. It is one of the most supportive film festivals that is out there in Australia and definitely has a really strong, well-connected uh, community of filmmakers. Be a part of the community. Be, uh, show up to like every hangout, every film festival, every event you can. It's all about networking, meeting the people from your like local community and growing together. This is what we're all about. It's all about the community. It's all about the filmmakers. This is what we do. We'll catch you next year at Made in the West Film Festival 2020. See you then and keep having fun.